Oh god. Oh, it's Fox Game? Well, actually, I can't tell. Was it Fox Game 1? Someone tell me in chat. I didn't see. I guess his Fox was looking warm. Last two sets. Might have been a bit shaky at the start of the tournament. He might just go Fox this tournament. I don't know if he's got a recent win on Ruben with Fox. I can't think of it. I know he's beaten him once and then lost twice. But I can't think of the most recent win. Oh. God. I guess we don't have to worry about the fox. Fox line of thought because we have a peach game one. Ooh, that was such a good fair. Oh, this is gonna be a long one. Oh, we're even looking a bit shaggy. Yeah, it's definitely what we've had. Oh, this is our third set of Peach Samus. Could have been fourth if um Catherine had Ruben round one somehow. Must get really warming Ruben up for me if he wins. Really unfortunate. Uh, did I up that this? I did. I'm good at this. I'm so good at streaming. Hell yeah, I'm gonna take the, this. Oh. Shaky start. Game one feels really important in this matchup. Like, actually, really important. Um, I don't know. It feels. There's. Because the sets are so long, it's so much pressure to make that comeback. And as well as dealing with, uh, well, I guess he started FOD, so he doesn't mind FOD. But dealing with two Samus counter picks is just like such a headache. Oh. I don't, Ruben's, uh, he'll just turn it on in spots and then he'll just turn it off in other spots. But it's like, but I guess it's completely understandable because it's so hard to play this matchup for extended periods of time. Uh, like it's, it's sort of just, Stay low, like it's mix up your timings a lot. Whereas, like, you really want to be constantly threatening the peach and making her doing super stuff, and then you just wave dash back or you just hold shield and do that. So, it's like a lot of just staying close enough to the peach without giving her freebies for not committing and like using your projectiles, using your grab really well. Yeah. Uh, it's weird. You feel, yeah, it, you just feel nervous in the same sense, but you don't have the sort of worry about SDing for no reason. It's just like normally the, normally the set's over and like someone made an outplay unless something like really unlucky happened, like last set versus this. So it's like, it, it is and it isn't because you're not really worried about your own execution. You're more worried about what you do and your opponent does. So it's both easier and harder to play than all matchups. But it is just long. It's draining. Like I got off the set and I'm just like, holy fuck, I feel drained. When I just played Ruben. Yeah, except Goody, the fact they have to get to game 5 last stop situations playing a floaty. Nah, what Goody, what Goody says actually, it, it is legitimately true. Just because um, they don't have the threat. Like, it's a lot like, they don't have the same threat of screwing up tech that Spacey's do. And they don't have the same pressure to press, like... They don't. So, their, their character doesn't suddenly shut down if they like lose their brain and their ability to press buttons. And also, they've sort of like been conditioned to play those slower, like the slower patient game a lot more than Spacey's have. Whereas, like when it gets to game five last set and both players are slowing it down, floaties are like a lot more standardized and used to it, and like not, not willing, like not don't they don't really. Do oh okay. This might be a counter pick war. Like, cause I'm pretty, like, Muscat almost certainly will counterpick Fox if Ruben stays Falcon. 
And Buzzcat's Fox, like, impeccable against Falcon for the most part. It's one of his best matchups. But... Being a, being, swapping from a, a 5 jump squat, squat character to a 3 jump squat character with no warm up is legitimately really difficult. Especially when you're swapping to the 3 jump squat character like Fox, where it like really matters. So we'll see. This is going to be an in interesting set. set. Damn, Ruben's like, this is like, Ruben's gone, um, like his Falcon's legitimately really good and like Muscat's the only Peach Muscat's touched is like in PM for like the last year and like random on ranked. I'm saying if, um, it is four, I'm saying if Muscat wants to switch between Peach and Fox. Yeah, he probably, he, like to be honest, like he'll probably lose if he stays Falcon. Yeah, that's right, man. Um... So this might just be a legitimate counterpick war, but like if you're in a counterpick war and you're an upper game, that's a really good position to be in. But also, um, the, the good thing for Ruben is uh, potentially if he wins this and he gets the game 5 on a counterpick war, he gets um, Pokemon Stadium still open. So we'll see. That actually could have been really smart of him to use Yoshi Story instead of Stadium here. Because if he uses Yoshi Story and wins this, then um, Stadium's still open for his Samus. So I don't know if he was thinking that far ahead, but it was a really, really smart stage pick by um, Ruben. Yeah, you can tell he's a Samus player, whereas F Tilt and his up tilt. Ruben's got the most annoying uh, Falcon F Tilt in the country. We've got the chant in the crowd, guys. Cheer it from home. Let us hear you. Oh, that's it. That is the power of Hungry Jack. Hey, in the chat, again, if you're SA, come down. Everyone's chill down here. Always a lot of fun. I'm having, oh, like, the, the, I, like, there's nothing. I'm, I'm so happy when I'm at these tournaments. Like, the vibes in the air are just, like, so good. Talking to everyone is so nice. So everyone's having a lot of fun, and it's still, like, seriously competitive. Dude, Ruben's got the cheekiest smiles. It's actually insane. Love to see you all here. Hopefully see you all for the next big cheese, even though this one was uh, glorified local. Unfortunately, we can get quite all the SA gamers. Still literally two top five members. Uh, not currently in attendance. That's how stacked we are. And it's still a fucking sick tournament. Surely do both. You do, uh, do SA and Genesis. It's like, the, they're equivalent. Yeah, I know. I messaged, I messaged, I, I, I did this on stream, I messaged Nick, and he was like, oh, Path of Exile, new expansion dropped yesterday, so I was I'm like, oh, shut the fuck up. Oh, well. We love Nick. I get it. I'm just happy we well, we got four of the boys, which is sick, and we got like a bunch of the other really good players. And I'm having a ton of fun, so it, like honestly, it doesn't matter. <laughs> Thank you, Josh. We need we need supportive bullying to get him to show up next time. Oh no! Oh no! That's not good. Oh, I'll update the source. Wait, so how would have counter pick picking even gone here? Like he said, FD Peach. Wait, no, he would like he would have had the counter pick. So he was like, Ruben's like he was like FD. Ruben said Samus, and then Muscat said, Okay, you're going Samus. I'll go Peach, which makes sense. Um, if I if I if I st if I feel up to it, I'm down, man. Oh, didn't see that. Uh, I was just excited, yeah. 
I don't know. Hopefully, I want, yeah, I'll, I'll just, <laughs> it doesn't matter how many people show up. I'm just going to, like, consistently run weeklies. Just so people, just so people can show up and they'll, like, be, there'll be a tournament there and there'll be, like, events. I don't know, I love this scene too much. It's too sick. But speaking of that, Muscat taking a huge lead. A spacey two stock is definitely like the equivalent to like, I mean, a uh, floaty two stock is like the equivalent to like an easy, like a spacey ditto three stock. If it's a low percent two stock, it could be four. I will try my best, Josh. I'm feeling good. Like, I think I'll win. Oh god, that, 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 that one's gonna be a bit harder, Josh. We'll see. We'll try. Oh, I still have so much shit to do when I get home, but that's okay. We're having fun, we're thinking. Oh, 6.30, oh my god. We, we went, this has almost been stream up for four hours. I guess that's what multiple sets of Samus Peach would do to you. And we could still have two more sets after this. Oh, Muscat looking a lot more dominant in this set. Hey, guy. Whoa. Nope. Bailey. It's yours? I know, right? You could, you could come here sometime. Do a road trip. We were thinking about doing a road trip down to Vic, but all the COVID shit happened, so very unfortunate. Oh, well. Such is life. I still, uh, like, hopefully I want to get... Yeah, I, I, I th I'm planning on going to the Orb locals. I know Lax is as well. Hopefully we can get, like, turn it into a little mini-major in Sydney before everyone goes to Genesis. What's up, everyone? Howdy. I'm back. I have food. And I have a beer. Oh, that looks so good. What the hell? I'm jealous. Go upstairs. Go Wait, upstairs. there's food upstairs? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Huh. Yeah, Michael's doing it. Oh! Yeah. It's, uh, there's pasta, burger... Uh, bon me and uh, something vegetarian. Damn, okay. See you guys. <laughs> Hope you enjoyed my commentary. <laughs> bye bye. In the meantime. Oh my god, Muskets just got such good neutral. Until he rolls into a grab like that. Oh, shit. I kind of like this matchup a lot for Ruben, but right now he's getting, I don't know, this um, a bit rocked, shall we say? Oh, 
Wow, that bit him, and then much of the up his shield. Oh shit! The elbow! Oh, he keeps it going! More high pairs. Oh, that was actually gonna be really good. It's fine, he's got the thing. This is looking good for him, though. Not, not gonna lie, this is looking good for him. He just needs to keep these combos up. Oh! Good DI from uh, Muscle. He didn't get hit by the cage. Okay, oh, that was good recovery there. That was almost insane. That was almost insane. It doesn't matter, he gets the stock. It's all good. The Falcon Punch is all part of the plan. Oh, it's, oh, wait, oh, never mind. 
as I say that, this could be the start of something beautiful. In the words of Black Shadow, it takes guts to be amazing. Alright. Ruby just literally can't get hit. He has one last chance. He makes it back. Does not get the tech chase. But he hits the shield. This is it. This is it. This is Ruben's one opportunity. Oh! We're just attacking out of shield out here. Like savages. Oh no! Oh no, this is a this is a oh, It doesn't matter. This is me. He can't get hit. He literally cannot get hit. Oh my god, how did he find that grab? How did he find that grab? And that's it. Amazing game, guys. Amazing game, amazing game. Up next, though. Good shit to Muscat though. Play pretty well.